happened so i'm gonna do another review comes watch video on the latest launch by maybelline which is their powder matte lipsticks they have launched these lipsticks in around um, eight nine shades i'll mention everything in the description bar along with the prices i picked four of them because as uh I don't know they had a lot of pinks there pinks and reds i already have way too many pinks and reds i was looking for some different shades but unfortunately they don't have much choices there i in terms of shade i found their creamy matte lipsticks range much much better and but these are powder mattes creamy mattes are like matte but they have a nice cream uh, formula but with powder mattes the formula is extremely matte and the finish is extremely matte uh, it gives you like a velvet matte kind of a finish i have picked four shades and uh, all the four looks i mean except for one which is a neutral rest three shades look almost similar to each other so we are going to swatch them one by one and then i'll share my thoughts on them at the swatches i will share the finish staying power formula comfortability and everything so the finish is powder matte which means that these will give you a nice powdery velvety finish it looks so good the finish is beautiful of these lipsticks and uh, these are like very beautiful matte but they do not feel uncomfortably drying on the lips which is so surprising my favorite shade is going to be get ready which is like uh, which is this one the orange toned red very beautiful very warm tone perfect for summers this is a beautiful color if you are looking for an orange to start with then this is going to be really pretty shade like an orange orangeish red i mean that's how i'll describe it um, i don't know i'm not very good with describing colors but i really like this color then the nude the touch of nude which i used is like a peachy nude i'm not into peachy nudes i'll more i like a uh, pinkish nude more but uh, if you love peachy nudes if your complexion is fairer than me then this color will be really good my lips but better like an everyday shade for you the formula is matte but it glides on so smoothly on the lips it gives you a beautiful medium coverage it will not give you full coverage it's a like a medium coverage formula it feels very comfortable but yes it's a matte formula so after an hour or so it will uh, accentuate or sh uh, highlight the dry patches on your lips so make sure to exfoliate your lips or scrub your lips before applying this i wore a uh, touch of nude and the uh, the other shade get ready uh, for a long time and they stayed on me for good like 5 hours 5 hours plus and the transferability is like uh, they do not transfer much which is amazing so give them some time to set and they will not transfer much also i love to use a lip liner a matching lip liner with these lipsticks because uh, to get a nice a uh, clean finish around your lips so if you're looking for nice comfortable matte lipsticks then these are really good options i'm really happy with the formula of both creamy mattes and powder mattes creamy mattes are for those who like matte but they not they do not want a flat matte drying matte kind of a uh, formula powder mattes are for those who love true matte lipsticks because this is like a true matte lipstick and so i i like the shades i like the formula and i like the finish i like i love this these lipsticks the only dis, uh, the only disappointment would be the shade range i would have loved to see more brighter colors there since the summer is approaching and uh, we already have so many reds and pinks right the difference between touch of nude and touch of spice would be the tone touch of nude is more peach tone and touch of spice is more pink tone my favorite is always going to be touch of spice for this one i need a, a lip liner so that uh, my lips don't look too washed out my face doesn't look too washed out 
and write this as a really beautiful shade if you love peachy nudes so i hope this video helped you in deciding whether you would like to pick these or not i think these are a good buy if you want to invest then these will be really good uh, really good uh, lipsticks formula wise yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you're watching me for the first time please take a moment and subscribe to my channel because i keep on doing such swatch videos very frequently very often and um, yeah i'll see you very very soon in my next video till then bye